All right, my name is Paula Ponte. I am with EXP Realty in Lakeland, Florida, guys, and I am here with Pablo. Pablo, all the way from Mexico City. All the way from Mexico City. Yes, <laughs> awesome. So Pablo, you and I had lots of um, conversation regarding colors. Yeah. So if you wouldn't mind just explaining who you are, what you do, and why color is so important. Yeah, of course. Well, thank you for having me here. My name is Pablo Rivera Espinosa de los Monteros. I know it's a big ass name. I, I'm sorry. Yeah, I just went with Pablo. But uh, I'm an image consultant, and basically what that means is I dedicated my entire life to the study of perception, right? How a brand, a person, or, or an object gets perceived by people. So you know, when it comes to perception, color plays a huge role because colors are almost like emotions like a frequency that you're putting on. So every time, you know, that's why we have our ties, which is a color, right? Colors play a huge role when it comes to putting a, an emotional state into people. You see it with brands, you, you see it with products, you see it with, uh, with your fashion. The moment you see a bright color, for example, what's the first thing that pops into your head? Happy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I feel happy. I feel yeah. bubbly. Like, oh, I feel alive. When you think about dark colors, what do you feel? It's you feel sad. Like, <laughs> you feel depressed. Although I'm not sad today. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. 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 Totally. Yeah. Totally. yeah. So colors are the number one thing that you need to be looking at when it comes to stepping it up with your style or with your brand or you know maybe your business card, maybe your your logo or your website is colors because they are speaking to you to your subconscious. I, it's, it's, it's a subliminal message and that's why it makes it so much more powerful because you're not uh, registering it, right? Right, right now I'm talking to you like, you're trying, oh, okay, it makes sense, it's worth whatever, but what I'm doing on your, on your need, that's speaking and that's getting inside of your subliminal mind and I'm making you do stuff without your permission and without you being aware of it. That's, That's very important. powerful. So let me let me ask you this: Does it matter in terms of what line of work you're in? So, for example, if you're in um, the restaurant business, or if you're a realtor like I am, or if you're a businessman, or if you're a financial planner, like does color matter? Yes. Yeah. That is a great question, and you know what? Yes, of course, it depends. I love that question because it's all about knowing your audience. It's all about knowing your environment, all right? If I am a judge, if I am a policeman, of course, colors are gonna be different, right? If right. I am a lawyer, I mean, it's gonna sure. be different. If sure. I'm a realtor, if I'm an image consultant, if I, it's totally different. So, you have to look at it with the people that you're, the audience that you're gonna be uh, talking to, all right? So, even if you're a realtor, but if you're gonna be doing, I don't know, commercial, right, uh, real estate, the colors are gonna be different than if you're gonna be rentals or the, 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 the other type sure. of, of, of uh, retail, retail yeah. of course. So color is very important because it's communicating, again, who and what you're all about, but without any words. Right. Without any words, that's what makes it even so more powerful. So you have to look at colors. Awesome. And when you have, last thing, if, yeah. when you have any doubts, just go a little bit extra, you know, go, go further, because we tend to be stuck in our comfort zone. Mm -hmm. Black. Sure. White, yep. gray, yeah, that's all I want to do. I mean, I'm going to today. But you know, that's why I got a little splash, I got a little yeah. splash of yeah, color, yeah. right? But uh, even with your logo and all that, you just think outside of the box and put on some colors, right? Add some colors, something different. That, of course, resonates with your audience, the needs of your target audience. What do they need to see, feel, and think when they see your brand or when they see you? And also, it's uh, just think outside of the box because we are so afraid of standing up. Uh -huh. We are afraid of, okay, this is a bright color, people are gonna look at me, right? People are gonna look at my brand and they're like, oh, what do I do? Now I have the attention, now what do I do with it? Yeah. So that's why there's a lot of other things that you need to be learning, but color, just push the, push the envelope a little bit. Oh, go the extra mile, right? Awesome. Well, thank you, Pablo. I think it's time for us to go shopping and to get me out of this black. So, uh, <laughs> thank, you. thank you so much for being here. All right.